There you go. Okay, announcements. First off, uh, this particular episode is going to be called, and it's not necessarily the theme for the show, but I've got to get this off my chest because up until now, I wasn't absolutely sure that we were being listened to with such great attention. And by that, I mean the Flat Earth community. But something has gone missing recently. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's the YouTube scoreboard. And if you don't know what that is, well, it's because it has another name. It's otherwise known as relevant search results, otherwise known as search results. They're gone. I, I did not discover this on my own. Somebody let me know as it was being propagated through the browsers. And that is if you type in any topic into YouTube uh, a week ago, you could have typed in uh, mashed potato recipes or George Clooney or whatever. And you could have typed things in. It would say search results equals whatever it was, f anything from 50 to 50 million. You would have seen a whole bunch of hits. And as you guys know, I had been tracking this. I had been uh, using YouTube as basically a scoring system to see how we were doing. And we started out at you know 50,000 relevant search results. And then we went up into the millions. And then they stunted the general filter so that you actually, to get the actual numbers, you had to go to upload date. Uh, Bob from Globusters pointed that out to me a while back, and we kept climbing that ladder. 14 million, 17 million, 19, and then finally, we caught the president of the United States. We were, we were trending faster than just about anything you could think of. And we caught him when we hit about 20.9 million search results, and he was at 20.8. And I made a show on it. I called that. I mean, literally a Strange World episode. You can go out there and look at it. It is called Flat Earth Catches the President of the United States. And when, uh, shortly after I did that, they decided to stunt that number as well. And we went from almost 21 million down to 14 in an evening, which is impossible considering nobody complained at all about having videos deleted. They just changed the algorithm and said, okay, whatever their number is, multiply it by three quarters uh, of a full, you know, of the full, of the total, you know, 70, 75 percent. And we'll just let those numbers go. And I called it on that, too. I said, all right, fine. You want to do that? We don't care. We're just going to keep. And our numbers kept going up. And then just within this last week, they <laughs> threw out the baby with the bathwater and removed search results entirely. It's not like it says search results and then the number is missing. That line is now gone from the browser. Just gone entirely. So now if you type in anything, it'll just pop up whatever pages it is. It won't tell you how many pages there are. It will not tell me how many results. And, and you're thinking, well, that's not a weird or a big, big thing. It's like, no, no, no. This is, this is where nerds hang out, nerds and geeks and dorks like me. Search results have literally been around since the internet was created, since the first browser came up. The, as soon as you could search something, search results was always part of that. It was always, it's still there now when you go into Google. So you go into Google, pop up that big bar and type in mashed potato recipes or flat earth. It will show you whatever we're at 300 and something million or 400 million search results in that. It's like pulling it out of that. And, and I, why is this, why is this important? It's important because they're listening to us. So rather than deal with us, you know, keep patting ourselves on the back. And I know I was the one leading the charge here saying that all oh, our numbers keep going up and up and up. Instead of dealing with that and uh, they just decide, you know, let's just torch, let's just burn the whole thing down. So they rip down the scoreboard and uh, now Flat Earth can say that we wrecked it for everybody. So, so whether you're looking for makeup tips or the latest uh, Tonight Show episode or whatever you're looking for, the search results are not going to be there anymore. It's just going to list pages of videos with no numbers attached to them other than the, the hits, which is just in individual videos. So anyway, I thought it was very interesting. So uh, it, whoever's listening out there who's been listening to this, uh, I'm very flattered that the Flat Earth community has done this, had, had the ability – to shut down the entire YouTube search algorithm. You just throw it out because of us. That's, that's fine. And I know it kind of sounds like Matt Boylan when I'm, when I'm saying things like that, this is not delusions of grandeur. No, no coincidence is when you run into your neighbor at the grocery store, this is something bigger and I'm going to stick. To, I just can't wait to see what they do next. So anyway, there you go. That's, that's the first thing on my list for 